Today we'll be exploring what happens when new plants or animals arrive in places where they don't naturally belong. These newcomers are called invasive species, and they can cause a lot of trouble in their new homes. Imagine you have a fish tank with a perfect balance of fish, plants, and decorations. Everything is living together happily. Now, suppose you add a new fish that's not supposed to be there. This fish might eat more than its share, grow too fast, or even spread diseases that the other fish can't handle. Suddenly, the balance is upset and the tank isn't happy anymore. Invasive species do something similar in nature. They come into an ecosystem and start taking over, often because they have no natural predators in their new environment. This means they can multiply quickly and crowd out the local plants or animals. For example, let's talk about the zebra mussel. It's a small shellfish originally from Russia and Eastern Europe, but has spread to lakes and rivers in other parts of the world. Zebra mussels attach to any hard surface, including water pipes, boats, and even other shellfish. They reproduce rapidly and can clog water systems, harm native species, and cause severe ecological and economic damage. Another example is the kudzu vine, known as the plant that ate the south in the United States. It was originally brought from Japan to help with soil erosion, but it grows so fast, up to a foot per day, that it covers everything in its path, from trees to telephone poles, blocking sunlight and killing other plants by suffocating them. The impact of these invasive species is not just on the environment, but also on the economy. It costs a lot of money to manage these species and try to control their spread. Efforts include mechanical removal, chemical treatments, and sometimes introducing another species to control the invasive one, which can be risky and lead to more problems. Understanding the impact of invasive species helps us appreciate the importance of maintaining natural balances and being cautious about moving plants and animals from one place to another. It's crucial for protecting biodiversity and the health of ecosystems around the world.